Good morning, guys. Welcome back. So this video couldn't come at a more perfect time because number one, I'm hungover. Number two, I am needing to cleanse my body so bad. So this, I'm gonna take you on kind of a three day, my experience of doing my very first cleanse. It's kind of like intimidating to me to do a cleanse and to figure out how to do it right, to blend up the product, to take the time to do it. With this service, it basically does the brain work for you, which is amazing. What I am doing um, for the next three days is a cleanse called Juice by Julie. Right to your door in this ginormous, beautiful box. And it comes with everything that you need for a three-day cleanse. And it also comes with a cleanse guide. So if you're like freaking out and you don't know how to do it, it will give you like a step-by-step -step on what to do. Um, it comes with six different juices that are blended, not cold pressed. And what that does, it helps keep all of like the fruits and the vegetables and the fiber that's in them in the juice. So it's fresh. You have about four days um, if you wanna refrigerate them to start the cleanse or if you wanna freeze it, you've got two weeks. It's definitely something that if you've always wanted to do, it's super easy. So the first one, that I am going to be drinking is the Sweet Spin, which has kale, spinach, pineapple, banana, mango, and rice milk. And it actually is really good. It kind of tastes like, it's actually so, it tastes a little bit of like leafy with a little bit of rice. So I wanted to share with you like my experience in case there's other people out there who have maps. No, I'm just kidding. Do you guys remember that like Miss America when she was like, it like wasn't even a, like a coherent sentence? So I wanted to show you this. So it comes with a drink and each of the bottles has a number one on there. So you drink number one, you drink number two, and you basically finish all six bottles in a day um, prior to about like two hours before bedtime. And then you start the next day and the next day. And it does allow for um, some raw vegetables, some egg whites, and some fruits if you get really, really hungry. I'm gonna try and do this without trying to eat anything. And I love sugar. I love sugar. I love coffee. I love all of the bad stuff for you. So I really ne need this. I think it's like almost 10 o'clock. I just woke up. We went out yesterday for our anniversary and I had a little bit too much to drink. And this cleanse is definitely something that I feel like I'm gonna need, especially after a hangover. Yeah, okay, so I'll be back later on the day with um, juice number two, three, four, five, six, and uh, I'll see, because I'm right now I'm hungry. I'm really hungry. That's why I'm gonna have this. So, love you guys. It has been a couple hours, and I am on um, number two, and this is the spicy lemonade, and it's got lemon, maple syrup, cayenne pepper in it. So excited. This is good too, it tastes like lemonade. Yeah, this just tastes like really yummy lemonade. I, I'm really pleasantly surprised because I'm very sensitive to textures and I'm a very picky eater. And so far I've loved both um, blended drinks. This is um, super good. It's only, it's like lunchtime and I haven't had anything to eat, but it's crazy because so far like, I'm satisfied, but I am not hungry. So these do really kind of curb your appetite and curb those hunger pains. I feel satisfied and I have energy, even though I didn't get great sleep because I never do when I drink. Uh, I feel like it's, like I'm okay and I've got energy. I've got energy like I would if I drank a monster drink. So this is number two. I'll be back with number three a little bit later. It's really good. Okay, so I'm on the third juice, and this is a green radiance. This is spinach, apples, strawberries, mango, coconut oil, and ginger. Ooh, smells very leafy. That's good. I like it. It almost has like a kick to it. So, shake it up really well. So it has um, like the sweetness of 
like the apples and the strawberries, but then you get kind of like that ginger kick. Like I would say that these are like sustaining me pretty well throughout the day. I do have like slight hunger, but it's not like you're starving. If you've never done a cleanse before, um, I see why people could probably do it for like a week or so because it sustains you in a way where you're not craving certain things like sugar because you're getting all of the nutrients that you need in these drinks. So yeah, really good. I'm not constipated anymore. Thank goodness that came on pretty quick. A and I'm going to drink the Chia Berry. I'm really excited to try this one. This has chia seeds, pomegranate, strawberry, lemon, and agave. I have noticed I'm starting to get kind of hungry. Um, I've noticed that when, like this fills me up to like a point, and then as soon as I pee it all out, I'm hungry again. So I just made my family dinner, they're eating. I did take a bite, I have to admit. But you're supposed to taste your food when you cook, so. <sighs> That's that. Um, so right now I'm gonna do the Choca Nana, which looks amazing as cocoa, banana, strawberry, pomegranate, and coconut milk. Uh, yeah, let me smell it. Oh, really good. It tastes like a chocolate banana milkshake. So, so far it hasn't been that bad. Um, I will say that our, um, I'll kind of give you like an overview of how I feel after the last one. We're gonna take the kids to a park downtown. This, doing this juice cleanse has really helped combat a hangover. So far, this one's my favorite. It just has chocolate and it's just really freaking good. Hey guys, it is the end of the day and I'm drinking my last juice and it is extreme green. This has spinach, kale, orange, pineapple, hemp seed, and a lime. I like this one. This has like a, like a nutty, um, peanutty flavor. I've been craving that like nutty taste, like, it's like peanut butter taste type thing. So that really helps. I've been drinking lots of water. I have been craving sugar. I haven't, so the next two days are gonna be a little. I will check in tomorrow after um, the day. See how that goes. This is like my second favorite. This might be my first favorite actually. Day one is a success. Um, I'm not overly tired at all and my body feels pretty good. I'm a little tired right now because we just got back from a hike. Probably shouldn't have done that because I haven't really had anything to eat today, so. Okay guys, it is day two and I am halfway through the day, more than halfway. It's about two o'clock and I am on my fourth juice. So all of the juices up until now were the same. I don't, now I can't remember if I had the chia berry yesterday but this one is chia seeds, pomegranate, strawberry, lemon, and agave. I don't think I had this yesterday. Really good. Um, you have to shake them up pretty well. And um, I really like it. So today, so day two is a lot easier than the first day. I feel like I still get hungry, but I feel like it's less often and I am craving sugars less. That's feel like, I feel like usually like if I want to snack, normally if I want to snack on something, it is like peanuts, pretzels, and maybe like a jelly bean or a Skittle here and there. But I do feel like since there is sugar in this, uh, that healthy sugars, I should add, that that craving has gone away today. I did really crave it yesterday. I'm hopeful for tomorrow that hopefully I won't crave it at all and then I can eat sugar less and less. I haven't had any soda, no coffee, and that surprisingly has not been hard. I thought that I would really get a caffeine headache or some type of side effect for not having any type of caffeine because I drink it daily and I haven't had that and I drink a soda like maybe once, like a half a soda or a full soda once a day. Helps the cravings. And I just pee a lot, it's crazy. I feel like I go to the bathroom more often, but it's totally healthy. I'm drinking a ton of water and I feel surprisingly really good. Um, I do have moments when I get super hungry, like right before I drink this and then I'm good for like 
I would say like about an hour, hour and a half. It is towards the end of day two. And I am about to pop open the PB and juice. This has all natural peanut butter, strawberry, banana, and rice milk. That's an interesting flavor because I can taste the peanut butter and I can taste the rice. And I feel like the rice goes really, really well with like the leafy greens. It's kind of like you're eating sushi in a liquid form. This is interesting. You can definitely taste more banana. It's still not bad. I mean, this is still gonna be really good in filling, I think, to sustain me. One more day to go. So far, I, no, ah, one more day. Um, today is day three of my cleanse. I am halfway through the Sweet Spin, which pretty much every day I've had this in the morning. And so today's my um, son's birthday and we got up donuts. We usually get donuts every morning on like a special occasion. And I want to like have a couple bites of a donut, you know, I don't know. I just wanted to have a donut and to celebrate his birthday. And I actually could not finish it. And normally I am all about donuts. I love donuts and my body, like it was actually kind of making me sick to eat it. And I thought that was really interesting because I've never had that type of reaction to sugar before. Like when my husband has taken a break from eating sugar, he, his body has that same reaction. And so I just wanted to hop on here and tell you this might be a really good way to go. Even if it's like a one day cleanse, a three day cleanse, they have those options um, with the, this company has those options and um, it might be a really good way to com combat. It might be a good way to curb your sugar cravings. So um, I am really loving the fact that I can't finish that donut. So I will get back on here and let you guys know two more drinks that are new for the third day and then I will bring it to an end and tell you my thoughts if you should do some type of cleanse. But I can tell you right now, I definitely think everyone should do it at least once. So I just got back from working out. It was probably the hardest workout ever because I've taken like five days off. I don't know why. And I haven't had a lot to eat like if anything. And so right now I am drinking the spicy pomegranate and this is basically like the lemonade, but with pomegranate. But there is lemon, there is maple syrup and there's cayenne pepper and it tastes kind of like a lemonade, but a little bit sweeter. It's not, I don't taste the spiciness in here like I did with the other lemonade. It's really good. And yeah, so, um, I didn't have a lot of energy working out. I probably shouldn't have done that, but I wanted to like seize the opportunity since my husband was working from home. Uh, and I probably won't be able to go to Orange Theory for like the rest of the week. So anyway, um, so far I feel great. Um, it was, I wouldn't recommend working out if you're doing this, except if you're like gonna do a very light workout, like walking or maybe riding a bike, that would be fine. But anything really high intensity, um, you just, I didn't really have the energy. But that was probably also a combination of, I haven't worked out in a while too. So um, yeah, I feel great. I am drinking this number two and I really like this one as well. I have four more to go and then I'll be all done. Okay guys, it is the end of day three of my first ever cleanse. And I have to say I survived. It was a little difficult at times because my body got hungry, and, but it was definitely easier e as each day went. Like the third day was a piece of cake and I probably could have done two more days. But if you're interested in cleansing your body and resetting it, removing all the toxins, I will link my 35% off coupon below. Now's the time to start. I think you. she's got other things on her website, snacks and soups and different things like such, like such as. And I feel, I guess, healthier. I feel less bloated and um, I don't think I lost any weight, but that really wasn't the reason why I was doing it. I was doing it more for the, for cleansing and the way it made me feel on the inside. And I have to say, I was pretty shocked that I did not need coffee or a monster drink. In fact, when I had a, like I said, a donut, I've kind of felt sick. So that's a good sign if you're really trying to either cut out sugar slowly or do anything like that. I think it's definitely worth it. And yeah, I will, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will talk to you guys later.